And we can see Vorteling Room, the Horda El Arba, uh, June 1st. The Horda Horda Tariban almost three minutes or two minutes of the open, as we shall feel RTY at the open up to three trades. Our first start is going to be 2.4 with fish trailing. Okay. But I move the first half on uh, Hazard market condition. The new, new, uh, new thing I want to do the strategy. I get Tanya. And then I buy the second half. I want to now two halves to the second half. It's um, a big six contracts now. So from this six contract, I'm using three contracts as 2.4 stop loss, so profit. And the, and the third half, I'm using two trailed and one extra in case I get the 15 points move. So if I get the 15 points move, I will add my third or my, my third half, or my third actually, my third contract, my sixth contract actually, I'm gonna add it to break even or add the nearest support resistance so I can catch the bigger move. And it depends. But I'm then, the beginning of the trade, I'm gonna move my two uh, targets here with the two and one, move it together. And I'm adding uh, one take the original, 44, 45, 46. That's it. We have almost less than a minute. So let's get guys get ready to trade. Let's get ready to trade. We have almost 45 seconds. You will hear the sound market open, so don't worry. Until I found another block or uh, watch. You will hear this alarm market is open. We have less than 30 seconds. Twenty seconds almost. Fifteen seconds. And five, four, three, two, one, and market is open. Let's see. No signal so far. Let's see. No signal, so chop a little bit. We might go long, and we are long. We are long, guys. We are long. We are long. Okay, we are long now. Let's see what can happen. And by the way, we might go short. By the way, we can cancel long, go short. So be mindful for that too. So you might cancel long and go short. By the way. Let's see. To be ready, we can cancel long and push short, period. Still in the trade. Let's target hit, nice. So now, you guys, we're gonna, gonna use the trailing. We're gonna use the trailing. So we are almost now 18 points from the entry. So I'm gonna use my stop lose now at, use the trailing guys, use the trailing. My stop lose now gonna be at, both of them gonna be at 18473 and no guys. My stop lose now gonna be at, 1875.0. Market now almost move. One second. Almost three points from the entry. Now, one second, not, not three points, but three points. Almost four, five points from the entry. So, I'm going to start using my, my five exit, my five, my five points uh, exit. So, I'm going to use now. So, I'm going to add my stoop lose now at. 1874.9. And you can still use yours. And, and this dot, if you want, I'm going to start to 
I'm going to just move this text and marker here. You can easy to see it. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. This is a stop loose here. See, this dot, this dot here is a stop loose. There is another one here. The first one is, you guys see the dot? You guys see the dot here at 175.3. This is a stop loose. This is a dot. I'm using the five points below the dots so I can catch the big move. I'm still at the tree. And I got, I got a, we got another short signal. So if we if we exit from this long, we can go short. If we exit from this long, we get short. So we're gonna do sell stop limit now at 1874.0. Actually. At 1874.1, 1874.1 short. This is a second trade. You guys make some profit from this trade. You can, you can, can, more. But this, but this is secondary. How many points you guys made? And like a like normal market stop us out. We continue our direction and direction. But let's see. And the five minutes window almost over. Yeah, five minutes on the offer to cancel this one. Cancel this three. Cancel this three. And meet five points. Nice. So if you guys are if you guys are POQ1, you should be done. If you guys are POQ1, you should be done. The screen, we, we make five points, so we should be done. If you want to get short, you can go short now. I'm gonna take this and send you a should be short now. You should be short, but I already missed it. I'm not gonna jump in. But we should be short. We should be short now. But I, I missed it. I already POQ1, so I'm done. Yeah, and this trade works works very nice. It's almost five points. Almost five points. And let's see. Looking for the 945 window. 945 window. Let's see if you're gonna have to have a trade on 145. But I'm I'm done with the POQ one. Make profit from first trade. It's not a big deal, not a big profit. Usually it's more than six points. I'm done, but these conditions, um, I'm fine. And this trade works so well. It's almost five points from the entry. Ooh, six points from the entry. Is matched our direction. Can you explain, please, what is a POQ2? I explained it many times. I told you yesterday, I explained yesterday and day before. I will, but not now. I will. But not now. If you guys want to go short again, there is another. I'm going to take one second. One second. 
is another trade you can take it short. Let's see if you're gonna have it. Still waiting. It's nine thirty eight. And we should be now looking at the stop limit at one eight six eight point seven. 186.8.7, sell stop limit. Do you guys see these dots clearly or not? Do you guys see it? Okay. So we're waiting short in RTY at 168. Uh, by the way, guys, we are officially in the bear market. And, and I have to say it, we are in the recession. We are in the recession. Oh, that's, that's, that's a new. We are in the damn recession. So that being said, we are short. We're gonna start moving our, st our stop losses all together at the first dot. You guys see that? This is our first dot here. See the first dot? This is the first dot. That's the beauty of it. You can keep can you can keep moving your stop loss like this with the dots. So yeah, three of them, the dots. Or two, if you have two contracts, it's okay. Or four, whatever. It's going to be a dot here and this dot. Because there is a dot here, you guys can see this dot right there. Okay, 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 okay. I'm still in the show. We have five minutes until the uh, until the late forty-five window. Still waiting. Are you guys take this train on the same way? Like This stopped out with small, small loose. I took it on sale anyway. So let's, let's, let's take a look before we go to the uh, another strategy. We can take a look another, we can take another trade because I already take one trade. If you guys want to take another trade, you can do it. That is serious. We have three minutes, turn to 45 minutes, window. The 45 minute window, it's like the 9.30 at all. First 15 minutes of the market, market like reacting 
this thing of <clears throat> buying and selling this to each other. Right? 945, always, always going to be a move at this time, most likely. If the market is slow at the open, which is choppy today, like up and down, usually the move will be at 945. Even, or if the market is open, strong direction, oh, so I don't need more than 945. Case like today, yeah, you need 945. At seven, please. We have two minutes until 945. You guys are gonna take this trade on life or seven? We have one minute. You guys, you guys take this third trade on life or on seven? What's your trading plan? Life, sim. We have almost 30 seconds. You guys see, market is starting reacting before the 45. And we have almost 15 minutes, 15 seconds. Sorry. And we have almost five, four, three, two, one, and 9.45, here we go. If you guys make profit in first trade, do not trade, okay? Do not trade. Be POQ1. Trading is not how, much, how, how many trades you take, okay? Take profit and go home. That's it. That's all you need. That's all you need. Profit every day, and that's it. Shopping 945. $30. Okay. I don't like dollars. I don't say dollars. Say points. Okay. We're not trading money. We are trading points. When you trade, never say dollars. Say points or ticks. It's points or ticks. You can convert it to micro, many, one contract, two contract, 10 contract, 50 contract, doesn't matter. Don't see those, ever. How many points you make? They're looking for this third trade. I don't know how we made 1.3 by you. I don't know how we made it. Our first trade was 2.4 profit and almost two points from the second trade, from the second contract. You almost make four, four to five points. How did you make 1.3? And we still hanging on this 945 trade. Oh, you took every trade you have. Okay. okay. We are still looking for this trade balance. So very, 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 very slow, 945. Very slow.
last charm. Very, very slow. We might go short by the way. And yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna have sales stop limit now at 1866.3 and we are in. We are we are short. We are short the 9.5. We are short. And our stop loss is gonna be a little bit higher, guys. Our stop loss is gonna be at one nine one eight seven one point six. Unfortunately, it should be this high. One eight seven one point six. Is going to be on the if you stop down, we stop down. But well, the market is so choppy today. That's why we. That's why I'm glad we made profit. We still at this trade. Anyone in the street now? They're waiting. Shall I hold it? <clears throat> we are still in the string. So now we're gonna start reducing the first half contract. The first half, gonna add the stop loose now. Start with risk. First half, and I'm gonna add my stop loose now at one nine nine one nine one eight six nine point one. 1869.1. This is the first half. 1869.1. Very choppy day. Very, very choppy day. Okay. 
Yeah. <clears throat> but we might start moving, which is good. First target hit, nice. So now we're gonna start moving. It's almost 34. I'm gonna start moving my first second uh, first half. Sorry, second half. Now it's gonna be at uh, almost 1867.9. 1867.9 market now almost 3.7 from the entry, which is nice. And my stop loss now gonna be at 1867.4. 1867.4. I'm not gonna use any movement because I'm still didn't reach the four the 40 the four points. And actually, I reach it now. So now I'm gonna start right. I'm gonna start now widening my stop loss a little bit. So I can catch the big move. Four points. So my stop loss now gonna be at one one eight six seven point six one eight six seven point six. This is gonna be my stop loss. Market moving, nice. And I'm gonna start now adding my stop loss again. Four points. So my stop loss now gonna be at. 1867.0. Like I said, if you want to manage your trade the way, the way you wish you want, if you want to exit now, you want to take profit, do whatever you want. I'm following my strategy. Still. Almost five points in danger. Gotta keep my stop blue the same. I'm not gonna move. If you want to exit now, exit, see some rejection, or a big event, it's up to you. It's up to you. But for me, I'm still, I'm following my, my setup. Right, so market move, start moving, man. It's five points. Nice, nice move, nice move. So now I'm gonna add my stop loss now at almost break even. Almost break even, both of them. Almost break even. Market move 57 ticks. Outside. Almost six points now. Yep, six points from the entry. Trade is out. It's nice. Nine forty-five three. I'm gonna take this trade life if I have a, a choppy, or choppy open, like a losing or break even or stuff. And now six points, so I'm gonna add my two clues now. It's gonna be at almost one eight six seven four uh, one eight six five point seven one eight six five point seven. Because the market moves six points, so this is a six sticks, yeah. Gonna be here. One, eight, six, five points. Oh, market move nicely. It's it's almost seven points now. <laughs> <laughs> Don't take me that you hold on three, please. 
almost seven points from bench. Now I'm gonna start tight my stop loops. My stop loops now gonna be at 1865.1. 1865.1. If the market moves 15 points, I'm gonna trail the two contracts and the one left, I'm gonna add it big even until the close. Even on seven points. So seven points, so I'm gonna start now. Add, add, tied my stop loss. So my stop loss now gonna be at 1864.7. 1864.7. Guys, we are we 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 helping. We going to what the area of one eight five nine point nine. Sorry, the area of uh, this big line, which is one uh, one eight five point nine one eight one eight sixty one eight sixty. So this is a big round number, and expect some rejection. If you want to exit at this number, you can. One is we uh, market rejecting the one eight sixty. Market rejecting 1860, the big whole number, big lo logical number, 1860. It's rejecting this number. So for me, I don't exit a whole number at all. I'm just letting you know. There we go. So market move nice, man. What is that, man? What's happening here? <laughs> what's happening here? Oh my God, nine points. What's happening here? What's happening here? So my stop. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, what's 10 points? What's happening? What's happening? 11 points from the entry, 11 points from the entry. So my stop loss now gonna be at 1861.5, 1, 1861.5, 1, my stop loss, one second. No, it's gonna be at, one eight six one eight six one point three one eight six one point three. It's gonna go stop. We already secured a lot of profit here. And the market didn't move 50 points. So let's see if they're gonna stop us out of move. So for the I'm gonna do the second contract here. I'm the first one because I have two contracts. I'm going to add it above this last pivot four ticks to see if I can catch a bigger move. And we stop that. How many points you got there? You left at 50 ticks? What's your rules for left at 50 ticks? Why do you left at 50 ticks? What? It's a nice trade, not bad. I'm just, what's the When I said I can leave now, if I don't need to leave, I'm just taking you. Okay? When you trade, when you trade, Lazim, you, you cannot think. Like you have to be systematic. Okay. When you want to what, 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 why you want to exit? Why? Why have you exit? If you say, okay, I'm gonna exit at four numbers, like even numbers, do it. But every time, without thinking. 
If you're gonna stick with the, with the training, do it every time without thinking. If you overthink the trade, over smart, I'm gonna do this time, I'm gonna do this this time, I'm gonna exit him early, I'm gonna take profit now. No. This is not how trading works. No. Anyway, so let's move on to another strategy. Here we go. Oh, what time is it? Oh, we already spent almost 30, 30 minutes up to one. So now, ES now is 16, oh, ES is very volatile, 16, 40, 16, 34, so 16, 30, 32, very volatile. So be careful, ES is very volatile, guys, very volatile. And it's kind of a chop. It's kind of very chop. This is a pivot area. Pivot, you didn't test it. I don't like it. Yes, garbage. NQ, same. I don't like it. NQ, we have this area here. We have this area here. What is ranging? So I don't like NQ or yes. Let's look at our another uh, breakout strategy. You got any signals? You guys watch the video about the breakout? So if you get short now, we'll be ready for both because we are already above the uh, 20, so it's not oversold. And looking for short ES or If you get short, we're gonna add our stop lose above the high swing high. It's gonna be here, let's see. So I didn't see your result, guys. What's your result today? What is your results? Any 5.8, which has five points. Who else? Number 30 bucks. Guys, anyone want to share results? Same five points. How about Rogers, Mahmoud, Farag, okay, which is Ibrahim. Devatallah, <clears throat> what's your result? A, Andrew. Five points. So I guess you guys followed my same entry and exit, I guess. Okay. That's cool. Mark, start moving now. Put it downside. 11 points overall, nice. RTI is going down again, yeah, yeah, yeah. Deeper pullback, put me downside. All the market going down, RTI, all, the, all of them down, if you can see. I'm losing on Dow. Why are you trading Dow, buddy? Why are you trading Dow? Why are you trading Dow? What do you need from trading? I don't know my, I don't know, I don't know any of you. I don't know what's going on with you. You lost your account in one day, actually in two days, six grand, and you told me that three weeks ago. And you told me I'm gonna stick with my plan. So why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? If you are a trading room, you make profit. What else you need? I don't care about Dow takes a turn or not turn. I don't care. Do you know about Dow? Do you trade it before? Do you trade it before? Do you think, oh, I'm going to jump this because I'm going to move here. Gonna You're going to lose your money, but if you have a strategy, you trade it before, you test it for a long time. You know what you're doing. You know what you exit. You want to take profit. Every, oh, by the way, you lost the issue. But you can still take it. 
is the ticket. I'm gonna add my stop loss here and my profit. <clears throat> so from here to there is gonna be almost 280 ticks. So my profit gonna be 440 ticks. So my profit gonna be 140. So almost, yeah, let's see here. That's it. So our stop loss gonna be at uh, 18, 18, 818, and profit gonna be at 7, 1.5. That's it. And then we undertake. We can reduce your risk a little bit for the stop loss at, at, at uh, 1830, 813.75. Listen, Andrew, uh, Andrew, sir. If you, um, 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 thank you, nice target felt. Can you want to take this trade? It was nice, fast trade, very nice. Andrew, everyone, if you don't, every, if you wake up in the morning and you just, what the hell I'm gonna do today? How I'm gonna take my trades? which market I'm gonna trade, which profit I will take, which stoop I will take, please do not trade for a month. And, and, unless you know what you're doing. If you wake up in the morning and you 100% sure which trade you will take, which market you will trade, when you will stop, everything. And keep doing it every day. Every day, like a job. For 30 minutes, 45 minutes, and you're done. And go do your job, go like do your full time job, golfing, go to the gym, do something else. But if you keep, if you keep, if you think, okay, because that was moving or less like it's moving, I have to take this trade because otherwise I'm, gonna, I'm not going to make money. It's not true because you're jumping. It's called FOMO, fear of missing out. FOMO will kill you, buddy, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you let it go. You have to let it go. Got it? Uh, <clears throat> like I said, <clears throat> I'm telling you my advice, buddy. I, I lost a lot of money futures. I lost, I lost a lot of money. <coughs> well, that means everything. Then I realized all of this was garbage. It's very simple. Very simple. Take two, three, three trades a day. Make your profit. Go home. That's it. We got a long signal in queue, but we're not gonna take long here. We're not gonna take long here. Omar said, you talk this trade on M in Q. Why are you talking? Why are you talking this trade? Why are you take? Give me a reason. Oh, he was asking about the uh, explain the POQ too. <coughs> yeah, like I said, this is not a, a QA session. So any questions you have in the Zoom meeting or Facebook group? We have almost four minutes. We can go quickly over the PQ2, PQ1. I'm gonna keep, I keep saying this, but I'm gonna keep the game for the last time. PQ1, it's called power of quitting for the first trade. So when you trade, you, if you, let's say in the morning, we, we take our two wife trade, our first trade. If you make profit on the first trade, you're done. Even one tick. Okay? Let's say you lose your first trade. Then you take the second trade. You lose both of them. Take the third trade. Until one of two things happen. Until you make profit or you reach your max lose per day, which your max lose per day should be written clearly on your trading plan. Okay, there is no, there's nothing called profit target. Nothing called profit target. Max lose, that's it. This appeal to you. So if you take profit, when you, when you are green, stop. Happened from first trade, you stop. 
disappear here. PQ2, even if you make profit in the first trade, you can take the second. Could sometimes moves happen after the second trade. And if you, if, let's say if you take first trade and it's, it's profit, second trade, it's losing, but you're still green. You're still green after the two trades. You're done. You're done because it's, it's, it's PQ2, power of quitting from the second trade. You're done because you already take two trades and you are green now. So you're done. If you take a second trade and you lost what you make and you are red or break even, keep trading, keep trading until you green or reach your maximum. That's it. So PQ1 is way easier. And for me, for you guys, as you guys beginners, please stick with PQ1. You don't need to do PQ2. You're going to lose what you have. Stick with PQ1. If you make profit, I'm done. So for me, I did adjustment for the PQ1, PQ2. If I move, if I get from the first trade more than from six points to more, I'm done. Today I get almost five points. So Marcus was like choppy in the open. So I didn't like it. So I stopped. Usually, when I get more than six points, I'm happy, go home, do something else. But if I like break even first trade or one point, two points, yes, I would take second trade until I'm green or maximum. I think if I am PQ losing PQ2, losing max, lose every day. There's nothing called max lose every day. Uh, if you if there's nothing called max lose every day. If you max lose every day, you're not a trade. Do, go do, do something else. Max lose, this should be happening very rare. What do you mean max lose every day? Okay. Nothing. Max lose should, should be like happening very rare. All right, guys, you're done. 15 minutes. Uh, sorry, it's 10 15 now. So we should go. See you all tomorrow at 9.15 a.m. Eastern time.